Hey, what's up, uh, Terrapat? I can't quite say your name. Welcome to the stream. Uh, I'm just, I'm still getting things kind of set up, so give it to me, uh, give me a couple of minutes. All right, cool. Sorry, everything's set up. Uh, besides my mic being a pain in the butt. Come on, stop moving. Okay, perfect. All right, we're good. We're live, hold up. Uh, that's the wrong one. Nope, we're good. We're here. What's up, guys? Sorry, I'm just like, everything's kind of everywhere right now where I the monitor's cool and all, but I got to get used to this chat box just chilling up here. <laughs> but, uh, why does it uh, always go quiet when I get in here? Uh, you know, because you scare us. Uh, more specifically, you you scare me as, as a person, as a player. So I'm just like, maybe if I say nothing, he'll disappear. Shh. I I'm kidding, by the way. I'm kidding. <laughs> so, uh, guys, welcome back to a, a YouTube stream. Sorry I wasn't able to get one earlier on uh, this last week. And I plan on to uh, doing that. But I just, I just wasn't around it. Because as you can kind of see, the office is... <clears throat> is kind of been has been kind of rebuilt and uh, i have a lot of plans for that table right back there which is why the lights are right there uh the camera equipment just chilling on my switch etc etc so uh big plans for that table more specifically for that over there i can't show you what it is but there's so something hidden there it's for a sponsored gig so there's that but i appreciate that summit uh you can play with subs um not really I, I don't really do that too often and it's not for the reason that you think right it's like i don't like you guys kind of thing no it's uh it's more of the uh i don't like to stay stuck into one single area as opposed to um being able to play i would say whatever i want more or less where i can go anywhere right if i want to do high tier which is where i usually play at or if i want to do low tier i can do that as well and maybe i want to play japan maybe i want to play russia maybe i want to play uh italy or something and not everyone has it so i'm like you know just to make things just a little bit even i'm going to um i don't even turn that fuck uh wait hold up Oh, oh, wait, no, wrong button. Wait, there's a blue button right there that uh, YouTube shows me, and I'm just like, oops. Uh, okay, I'll just, we'll just leave it to that. I'm not trying to make money off the, uh, the the actual physical live stream, but you know what I mean by that. Uh, yeah, you want to switch it up. Exactly. I did do an oops. Perfect. Uh, with that being said, I do want to go ahead and play uh, with viewer requested vehicles. So give me a couple of games to warm up a little bit, get in the zone. And uh, we can definitely do some viewer requests uh, from you guys. I don't have a system in place to say, hey, you know, you're in line kind of thing. I'm just going to take them as I see them. Does that kind of make sense? I'll, I'll give the call out to you guys and say, hey, let's do this. Let's do that, etc. Also, sorry for the notification last night. Did... Uh... Did you guys get the uh, stream starting notification like 12 hours ago? I, I not even that really, maybe like 10 hours ago because yeah. Uh, what I can end up doing instead in the future is I'll post up that uh, going live post probably like an hour before the stream starts, maybe 30 minutes. Uh, Cause I thought, you know, when you made that, uh, that post, it would say, okay, upcoming stream at so-and-so time but it throws up the notification and then it throws up the notification as the stream starts. I'm still getting used to this, okay? So I'm still wrapping my head around it. Uh, it's, by the way, it's gonna be tanks. Tank airplane, possibly, but it's you, get, you gotta have a ground vehicle with it. It's gotta be for the BR. So no saying, hey, play the M22 with the F-16. Like, no, <laughs> we're not doing that, right? 
the fire challenge started it has a naval mission uh we'll talk more about the war thunder mobile which did go into open beta i did play it by the way and it's um let, let's just say it's interesting i don't want to make a video on it but i think i might have to <laughs> anyways let's uh get to the main scene and let's get started so sorry i was just popping some boosters uh i don't know what to start off at so in any place without a doubt we'll just start off with uh the russians just to kind of warm up a little bit shall we and let's do some top why not it's a good, it's a good way to start right it's, you you want an easy w here you go watch us get our asses kicked so hang tight let me um let me do some warm-ups I won't go into detail about it. Uh, I'll do that probably on my own time. Boo, Russia. You know what? Listen. Listen. They are the handheld easiest nation to play right now. And it's a hell of a way to start. All right. This is like, okay. Let's get the blood pumping. Let's maybe get our easy W. We're probably going to get our asses kicked. I mean, there's a possibility of that. Oh, by the way. um, I'm going to try not to curse today. No promises. Bye, Prince. You know, I wanted to, but back when it was uh, when it was super hyped up, when they were uh, not reselling it, but there was like a huge discount about it a couple months back. And I wanted to, but just never got around to it. I forget what the reason was. No, 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 no. It's oh, it's the 249. I love the e the little emo that comes with it. By the way, that's awesome. Uh, yeah, the reason why I say I want to hold back on the swearing a little bit is because. Uh, YouTube is kind of picky about that, and they can demonetize my whole channel just off one stream. No one? Ah. Like I said, there's always one chicken nugget that comes this way. Sorry, I had to identify what that was for a second. I realized, oh, that's an HCVL. Oops. Did you notice I hit him in the upper front plate angle and it still went through anyway? Sorry if the game's too loud. Let me know if it isn't. Or if it is or isn't. my left I got friendly he's uh or hostile to my hard left here whoever that guy was he was hauling ass out of there Oh. This guy is completely clueless. Just, really? Pop and smoke. Sorry, guys. I'm not focused on the chat or the stream at all. Do I need a warm up? Hey, uh, not a whole lot, dude. Realizing my microphone's kind of in the way and it's driving me nuts. I'm boned. Never mind. Uh, I'm not boned. My God, this guy has no idea what he's doing. You serious, really? No, seriously, that guy was just—he was panic shooting, man. Hey. 
Eh, you got him. Do you see what I mean? You see what I mean about the whole like uh hold up? Oh, by the way, the keyboard cam uh is in the works again. I'd love to do it, but Come on, buddy. I know you see. Notice how it gave me target destroyed, and yet he was still able to shoot me. Oddly enough. Yeah, no, no, seriously, this is uh, why is so much purple. I think it's like a special item, something like a comp status or something. I don't know, but notice how I'm just holding W and I'm getting the W. Amazing, isn't it? Stormer next. Uh, I'll do one more warming up. And then uh, we'll see about doing some requests. You got shot in the lower glacy. Oh boy. Yeah, I feel like that would happen. On how you came to love War Thunder? You know, that's an interesting story. That's a, that's a super interesting story. Uh, DPI, I, I said it years ago and I haven't touched it since, man. Um, 2015. I just... Uh, I was looking... I was just on YouTube, right? I was just fucking whatever on... there. Well, I just cursed. Holy shit. <laughs> See, it's just part of my vocabulary, man. Uh, I'm just on YouTube. I'm just playing, watching videos, whatever. And then all of a sudden... I get a like a weird like let's play. Oh, we gonna play this game, huh? Give me a second. Give me a second. You know I can outturn you, right? Give me a second. I'm not focused on the chat at all or my story. Player. Oh, doesn't look like it's working. It didn't work. He crashed anyway. Oh, I'm glad that worked out pretty well. Oh, it was a Kernass. Fuck. Oh, well, that's number two. I was looking for the F-16. Well, let's see what we got. Oh, we only got one guy left, so you know what that means. When in doubt, bring other pants here. One of the best, or not, I'm sorry, not one of the best, the best SPAA in the game. Sorry, buddy. Not sorry. Okay, my defense, he was the last one. All right. It's because it has the word ass in it. <laughs> Can I throw on it, right? No, no, no. Okay, so go, go back to that story. Uh, 2015, uh, I get a random video, oddly enough, from Baron Von Warthunder at the time. Baron Von Gaming. I don't know if you guys remember who that was. Um, and I, I look at this tank and I'm like, holy shit, this game's interesting, right? What is this? And it's a free-to-play game. And I just uh, rebuilt my PC, uh, or I was just in the process of rebuilding my PC. So I downloaded the game on my PS4 at the time. The game ran like ass. All right, just, I, I don't know how you guys can deal with War Thunder on the PlayStation 4. It just, I, I would rather run it on my Switch. I feel like it runs better on that, but. Like, probably a, a worse way to go about it, but let's just say it's better, okay? And I'm like, okay, whatever. So I didn't touch the game at all. Uh, for a couple of months after that. Uh, and then I finally rebuilt my PC, right? It was a uh, 4790K, uh, two GTX 970s and uh, an SLI. And it, it was like, it was a beefy PC, right? At the time. And uh, I downloaded War Thunder and I was like, okay, this game is cool. I'm confused as hell. 
So I ended up watching Baron, Fly, and Slick B. Those, those big three at the time, anyways, right? Well, Fly is still the big three, but you know, Slick and uh, uh, Baron are both gone from War Thunder, unfortunately. I got to turn this off really quick. I was using this for Dead Island too. Not that. Uh, off. Okay. Sorry. And to make a long story short, uh, I've been playing the game ever since. I took about a six month break. Uh, ooh, thanks for the 10 bucks. <laughs> I appreciate that. I gotta get the sound bites and the notifications set up, but, um, I took, I took a bit of a break, uh, for months and I restarted like my love for War Thunder back in around 2017. It was around the time when the T64 was coming out, right? Or like slightly before that. And I've just been playing ever since and I have almost 2000 days login. So, <laughs> all right, one more game. We'll play with the US for a little bit just to warm up, you know, get a different feel, and then we'll take some requests, all right? BTR80 is coming though. Oh, I know. Hey, did they uh, drop a new dead block for some of the new event stuff? Yes, I, I, I've actually played it well before the open beta came out. I'm going to say I'm not terribly impressed with it, but I'll save those opinions for a little later. VA truck just a meme of a vehicle I mean there's nothing crazy about it show my medals I mean I mean sure cool I, I, I don't pay attention to these so I think you brought the wrong vehicle you know when the update's coming I don't all uh, right, take last year's and just kind of play around with those numbers. Uh, the M1 KBT, yes, I'm getting it. I'm going to have gotten a uh, gift to me so that I may make video for review and play and be like, look, a premium Abrams. It's not free. Come on, there's always like one or two chicken nuggets that like to come this way. That's not good. Go to bed. Don't, don't, don't stay in my stream. Go sleep. Sleep is more important. He's not too happy about that. I wouldn't be too happy. I'm just cautious out to my left here on the field. Oh, by the way, they fixed the trees finally. So if you shoot the damn bush and the tree, it actually disappears the way it's supposed to. But I will believe it when I see it. Kajinas have been having a bad habit these last couple of updates, like small updates, uh, saying that they fix certain things and then just completely making it worse. Second target. I think they got him. Uh, the reason why I don't carry the task is because it serves no actual purpose. Uh, sure, it can stop uh, heat FS, etc., and maybe some missiles, but in truth, I never found it to be super useful. And that extra 50 cal mounted uh, doesn't really benefit me too much. So I'd rather have the same performance and abilities as the original M1A2 versus you know having a, a much higher profile a shot trap of a fragmentation trap if i like to call it more or less with the uh uh with the not the crow system but you know taller machine gun emplacement i guess <laughs> and it's just like hey this is a shoot me here beacon or i'm sitting right here beacon uh and it also slows down the vehicle overall so i figured yeah i'd rather not use it cheeky bastard We can do reverse. Um, I think it's going to be the same. 
for the event itself uh as the previous ones such a, oh by the way i'm sorry if i can't get to every single one of your questions the chat's kind of zooming right now but um i think it's gonna be like get thirty thousand uh mission points is my guess okay we're losing the big point all right i need to uh me adjust this mic it's just getting in like the way of my map that's better Oh, I don't have either. How can you compare the two? <laughs> it's like, wait a minute, what? All right, let's move. I, I do need a mic boom. I like this one and all, but I definitely need a better microphone boom that goes over. run I love the impact round but sometimes she got her problems uh copy the k2 uh you know the k2 is is more or less korean abrams right if you take a look at the development history of the vehicle ooh. Rude. No, nah, he's trying. He tried. Give me a second. Give me a second. I'm not paying attention to chat. Oh, thanks. You got my ammunition. I got one round left. All right. I'm going to die doing this, but that's okay. I just want to get out of this freaking spot. The sping? I'm a, what? The sping? There's a video. I mean, I could probably do a little later. After this game, we'll do the, uh, the request. So how it's going to work is... You're just gonna I'm gonna ask the question and the first one I see or the one that I find of interest, I guess, whichever comes first. Um uh, we'll play. Oh, I can't wait for this FU2 too. It's gonna be so nice. Better thermal uh, not better thermal sites. Uh actually I think it's just better protection slightly, but I could be entirely wrong. The LT is based on the K2. Really? Ladies and gentlemen, the average C10 fire. Target right side. Oh, 
Ah, uh, looks like a Puma. I know, I only got three rounds left. I get it. PSO uh, leak going around. That's an old leak now. That's been around for months. I think like a month, maybe two months now. The Leopard PSO is coming. How are they going to implement it? I have no idea. I'd rather they do it as a texture thing. But at the same time, it's like, I personally don't think we need a new Leopard. Maybe we need a, uh, a buff to an existing package. Oh. Damn, I just, I heard the guy and then there's that guy too. Oh, there's no pants here up. Judging by the fact that we have no aircraft up, I'm pretty sure there's a pants here or something up. I'm gonna help. Fuck, oh, you got him. Where the f Oh shit. Damn, I need to drop this. Oh, I yeah, has a pants here up anyway. Damn. Wouldn't have mattered. And my team fell apart. Big shame. Mm, we have a chance. So, it's funny that you mentioned about the pack sale. Can I point something out really quick? And I'm sure many of you guys are probably gonna maybe agree with me or disagree, which, you know, either or is completely fine. So Gaijin tricked me, not in the bad sense. I mean, being tricked is, is never a good thing, but uh, but not in the hugely bad sense. So you guys know that right now we have the 30% off sale, right? I mean, of course, you guys should know by now that we have the 30% off. Uh, I'm not just sitting here trying to advertise my 3% either. No, it's way too low. Gaijin released the uh... nice uh they released the kv uh the m1 kvt as the uh, pre-order and i thought okay you know we're, we're getting that that's completely fine i don't mind it at all okay dead block season started right and then all of a sudden they stopped and i'm just sitting here wait wait like wait a minute why, why are you bringing in dead blogs for this thing when you know there's none to be had right and then it, it, it dawned on me that they released the m1 kvt as a way i think to offset the sales for the 30 percent discount and then the vehicle packs coming out too so they did the same thing with the uh with the 2s38 where they released it as a last minute thing right before the sales came out like i don't think it was supposed to come out i think they only did it to offset the sales a little bit and I thought, man, that's just, you know, that's a great business pra practice, but yikes at the same time, right? I don't know. What do you guys think? Is that plausible? Am I just being, you know, you know, total ass or? I don't know. Nice. I think it's the same guy too. It's a CTV here. And I'm not I'm not uh not streaming on Twitch. I'm just not streaming on Twitch right now. Run, you little chicken wing. Run! Hey, where'd you go?
I got a hate round loaded. Fuck, I knew that was gonna happen. Damn. Oh. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. That's why I popped smoke like that to get rid of it. That's all right. Yeah, I saw the economic changes. I saw that helicopters are getting boned in the arcade. That's not my problem at all, nor, nor is it a concern of mine because I don't play arcade, so. There's that, I guess. The Claire is a good tank. It's actually a solid tank. It's just, it needs a better shell type. Nice. Woo! That was a hard game. Wait, did I bring 50 rounds in this thing? I must have been sniping with it a while ago. All right, that was good. Let's uh, let's do some requests. Oh, great. He says Stormer. <laughs> Just spammed out with the emote Stormer. You know what? Listen, I'll honor that. All right, let's let hold on. Let's do let's do Stormer. All right, we'll we'll take it out as a as a start, and we'll just play air defense and conversate. Cool. Hmm. I'll replace the Apache. I don't like the uh, the Apaches in general in War Thunder. What's up, pro? Oh, you even here on the on the uh, YouTube side of things, huh? <laughs> Oh, uh, I was thinking about pulling one of my Twitch stream days for two days a week here on YouTube. What do you guys think? I mean, I stream anywhere between three to four times a week uh, over on, on Twitch, and I spend like an extra day here on YouTube, right? But what if I just took a day off from there and moved it over here? What would you guys think? And the reason why I say that is because... YouTube offers such a wonderful experience when it comes to quality. I mean, you guys right now are watching this at 1440p at around almost 20,000 bit rate. I don't do 20,000. I do a little bit below that because that's kind of like the threshold for 1440p. So you're basically watching a video. Quality. Sort of. Yeah. <laughs> Does that make sense? Oh, this is such a good map. Guys, I'm going to bring out the Charlie 2 first um, before we uh, before we bring out the Stormer, okay? Oh, I wish the, the chat was uh, was a bit, like, larger, you know, without increasing the size of everything. Uh, I'm not going to multi-stream. You can't do that. Twitch. Oh, no, Twitch is always going to be the better platform for streams. I just, I hate the, uh, I hate the quality they, they give us, you know? It's like, come on, give, give us... Give us some higher quality stuff. Give, give us like 4K. Give us 1440p at the minimum. That's okay. Where'd you guys go? I should have brought more ammo. Guys, can barrel breach. Okay, I need to I need to move nine rounds left. Damn it. I should have brought more That was satisfying
Ich hab Aiden. I have an idea. <laughs> I have an idea. By the way, I don't play Britain very often, so. Wonderful time to bring out the stormer, huh? Like how fast this thing is. It's so nice. Like come back, like when you're playing this thing, it doesn't feel like you're playing like a uh, with the Charlie too. Don't take my con demeanor for uh <laughs> for me thinking like that's a normal thing. It's not. <laughs> I'm actually getting inside. I'm just not showing it. Before I get this, let me uh, see if I can kill the chicken nugget first. Got his breach. All right, we'll leave him like that for a little bit. Add the Indian tree. Uh, I don't know. I'm sure they will at some point. I mean, I'd love to see the Argent tank at 9.7. I think it'd be brilliant there. I pride myself on my helicopter snipe, by the way. So I'm supposed to bring out the Stormer and yet I'm just helping demolish the team with the uh, Charlie 2 e I'll take that. Oh, balls. You got to move up a little too high, buddy. You've got no gun depression. I got all the elevation on you. Oh, I'm boned. There it is. That's all right. Bring out the stormer. Russia copy? It's not Russia copy. I mean, everything is kind of everyone copy. This thing's not spaded, by the way. change the scope scale the range or anything that's fine i mean the the stoma <laughs> yeah type 10 with the additional armor packages you mean with like the heavy armor kit yeah i agree I mean, I, I for some reason thought we were gonna have like some sort of type 10 with JM33 only uh, and like a light armor kit. So the thing's basically a light tank, but a type 10. Because if you didn't know the type 10, you can modify it with uh, lightweight, medium weight, and heavyweight armor packages depending on the environment because it is my, it has like awesome modularity. I'm dead. Yeah. Oddly enough, I didn't catch him on radar. Well, you call it a radar. My turn. Uh, 
I I mean, let, let, let the guy let the guy have his fun, all right? If he wants to talk about India, you know, War Thunder bringing India into the game, let him be happy about it. Hey, just no harm in it. I personally don't think India is ever going to be coming into War Thunder. I don't really see a, a valid reason for them outside of maybe a subtree to an existing nation. I don't know which nation you can put it under, to be honest, but I'm sure they can have something somewhere. I was too close anyway, so I guess that's that's fine. Damn. Uh, Subtrees is is the way to go, but you know what? I have a solution. I, I'm sure many guys won't agree with this, but it's okay. Have any of you guys ever played the? Um, uh, hold up. Let's do the Black Prince. He's been asking for it. Let's do the uh, Black Prince. Um, if you guys ever played Armored Warfare, I think I, I made a, a, about two videos, I think, on it a while ago, and I abandoned that project, unfortunately. Um, let me bring this out. What is it? 6 0, roughly? We'll put it right here. Uh, they have basically different trees with different vehicles in the way of if it's an if it's a NATO tank, it's gonna be in that same tech tree, right? If it's like a, a European or an Asian like nation like a, or a Asian type or Russian type, anything like that, they'll be in their own separate trees. So what I think we should have, and this is just a you know, I would say a random ball in the park. Um, that made sense. Where you bring in a European, like some sort of like extra tech tree, right? And you have all these vehicles inside of it. And what happens is once the nation becomes available, you pick out those vehicles from that spare nation and you bring it into where it needs to be its corresponding area. And we got to pull down to your two. Holy shit. That's interesting. Um, but here's the cool thing. That nation can play either side, you know? So if there's like Korea, if there is Indian, um, Hungarian or something like that, right? It'll be inside that tech tree and you can be paired on either side. So it's not going to be like the same, you know, like hungry versus hungry kind of thing or India versus India. It'll be like, okay, India's on this team. Now this team is going to have that extra other nation that's sitting in there. Right. And then once the tech tree comes in, you move it outside of it like a Commonwealth tree. Yeah, exactly. You just put them in the corresponding areas. I'm just going to CC max just let this thing drive <laughs> it's gonna be a while until we move the japanese tree yeah no, i agree well the adf is the air defense fighter i think it's just have more vehicles i guess i know the mercs a little bit yeah Kika? I don't play the Kika, I don't know. I have it, but I don't play it. My friend, uh, her name is Silver Dombrake. She's a VTuber over on the Twitch side of things. And she is obsessed with this thing. For, I, I shit you not, for the longest time, she's like, Justin, let's play with the Black Prince. And we play it, right? And she was just super giddy about it. Like she's, if you don't know who she is, she is a, a wholesome, wholesome streamer. So definitely take the time to go uh, check her out. Hungry Poland, exactly. Toth gets it. Uh, VTuber is called a virtual tuber. They're basically um, animated characters, anime characters, more or less, custom design. And it's just basically like it's a live anime, more or less, if that kind of makes sense. Uh, and it's an easy way for uh, creators who don't want to show their faces to actually do that, which is very unusual, I think, because 
a lot of uh vtubers that i've seen from other like platforms like other ones who've shown their faces they're like really cute and they're like they're really like beautiful people and it's like i mean shit if i was beautiful i mean if i had a better head of hairline i'd be like yeah i'm gonna show my face all the time doesn't look clear top gear i'm not a fan of top gear and mean cars don't really match or work well together and nuclear uh yeah they're gonna bring in the r73 after they nerf the r60 or something watch just you wait they're just waiting for the stats to go down on the uh the mix 29 I like the memes. Ah, uh, this is so slow. The enemy had to come to me. <laughs> ah, it's okay. I'm using the Arctis Pro Nose, the wired version. Wireless gave me too many problems. I got a weird feeling someone's going up behind me. My goodness, we are so slow. M22 kick his ass yeah I'm gonna say well done I didn't mean to go for his barrel but you know if it works it works Like the dragons. Oh, absolutely from Gates? Hell yeah. I, I hate how they're just like a Fox 3. <laughs> Please, YouTube, don't get on my ass about it, alright? It's a joke. But it was it was the funniest thing ever. Oh, by the way, if you like tanks and guns and anime, Gate is definitely a brilliant series. I've seen it several times in English and uh in Japanese uh dub. I prefer the Japanese version. I had a weird feeling somebody was over there. It is the perfect spot to hide in. Make you realize he damaged my breach. My civilization game. Yes, All right, give me that track. Now I'm going to slowly inch my way over to you and put a sabo right here. Oh no, guys. Oh no. <laughs> this thing that down here is a bully. Please don't bomb me. Are you from France? Uh, this is a joke, of course. I don't know if I should be insulted or if I should, you know, take that as a joke. <laughs> oh, I know this one camping us.
I am from the good old US of A. I have two firearms within an arm's reach of me. Um, I have a Chihuahua behind me. And I hate taxes. Who likes taxes, but I hate them just a little bit more than the rest, I think. How's the Stella? Ah, it's good. It's, it's fantastic again. Slow flying aircraft with no flares. But most people don't realize that, oh, that's a Stella missile. I should get bombed right now. Interesting. You can shoot him on pipe watch. Told you. I'm just gonna slowly break this track. And or you can break my machine gun, that works too. I'm dead. Told you. Show shattered, by the way. Oh yeah, we lose. Let's get out of here. Uh someone said the AGS, so I'm gonna go to the AGS. Oh don't don't worry, I saw it. I mean, what was I gonna do? Rush over to him and help? <laughs> Oh, APDS is garbage. It's it's amazing too because it used to work so freaking well, and now it's just it's absolute garbage. But it, it is what it is. Um, AGS ten three is it? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, we can do the type eighty seven later. Oh, wait, who paid me to play the church show? You guys did. Your views. Uh, okay, small version. Got it. Ooh, full down tier too. Nice. All right. Let's do it. Um, I might not do that right now. Unfortunately, I my, my views are just are down hard. Um... So right now I'm focusing on my projects that I'm gonna be releasing tomorrow, hopefully. Uh, I'm not telling you guys what it is, but it's almost done and it is surprisingly really, really, really fun. I know English is terrible, but that's the only way I can kind of convey my uh, excitement for this, I guess. And you know what's funny? I know for a fact it's not gonna get good views. I know it's not going to, but it's it's gonna be fun, you know? Uh, I don't really squat up. At all, to be honest. I'm sorry. I might change that, but we'll see. No spoilers. It's something you would never expect me to play. And it's not low tier, so don't worry. Fuck. Ah. I didn't know he was going to rush up that hard. I thought he was going to chill back a little bit. And no backup either. Oh, well. I got way too overzealous on that one. Like, oh, way too overconfident. Oh, did he? Oh, hell no. Oh, no, no, no. It's War Thunder. Don't worry. It is War Thunder. And the M41D, I'm never touching that vehicle. Ever. Like, you, you will legitimately... There are two vehicles uh, in the game that you will never see me play. Uh, and that is the M41D and the KA-50. Hey, you, know, you know how much I, I just say, like, I don't like uh, the KA-50? Don't use my 3% on it. Go use someone else's. That is how much I do not like the KA-50. Don't use my 3%. Go use someone else's oddballs. Go use flies. You know, but don't use my code for the KA-50. Yes, Way too overexposed. Target front. I don't know where it is. Next 
What's up, homeboy Jesus? How you doing? <laughs> Yes, I'm carrying way too much ammo. I know. T-64, T-72 coming up now. Looks like an A model. And it looks like his turret traverse is booty right now, so I can get to the side of him and get him maybe. Oh, Joe. I think I have to honor that one. He's three. You want me to suffer, huh? I suck with that thing, to be honest. Got it. By the way, why do I bring a full rack on this thing? Uh, the armor on it is is non-existent, so it's like I, if I get shot at, I'm gonna die anyway. It doesn't bother me too much to bring out full ammo. Target front, he completely missed me. Twenty mil too. Uh, yeah, he twenty milled me. That's funny. Uh, CCVL. Oh, can I have better teammates, please? Just, just a few better ones. I'd appreciate that. The I4 is the worst. Well, I guess because what? The I7's at, or the I3's what? 7-0 now? 7-0 versus 7-7. Seven, seven. No, Death Server's not open. No reason for it to be. It's on tall. Yeah, it's on tall. Okay. Okay. Hey, uh, when I uh, really quick, guys, when I do the call out for vehicles to play, uh, just you know, we'll we'll pick the vehicle then. So hold out, don't try to like get ahead of yourselves with that if you could. It just it saves the chat a little bit, and um, you know, those who want to get their word out can can get it. That's one. Double kill? No. Interesting. Oh, I, I wasn't going fast enough. That's my fault. That'll get him, though. I missed. <laughs> He's destroyed. I know I could have gunned him. Uh, Viva 5 garbage.
perfect. Nice. I don't think this guy likes me. Nope, maybe he doesn't see me. Don't flare, don't flare, don't flare, don't flare. Hits you anyway. Oh! Chop off his wing. Very nice. Oh, bag light got me. Damn. Damn, so close. <laughs> he didn't like me. Okay. Why not? Just because. Tornado? Oh, hell no. I won't touch the tornado. Sorry. Uh, I won't even touch it in ground RB. That thing is, is doo doo. Nice. The <laughs> Mystic just crashed trying to kill this phantom. <laughs> nice job. Dude, right? Arden, it's so nice. I love it. Call the Leclerc. I mean, we'll look into it. That's a scary vehicle. That's a really, 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 really scary vehicle for us. He might get us right now. <laughs> Damn, I got stuck. That's all right. I brought that out as a meme. Now I'm bringing out the not meme vehicle. Oh, yeah. The new repair cost is bullshit. Did you guys see that the KE-50 is not the cheapest helicopter in arcade? Every other helicopter is like 23, 24,000 Silver Lions, and the KE-50 is like 6,800. Are you serious? Gotcha. For real guys, come on. Like I understand you gotta show favoritism, but damn. He's an A, huh? It's a rare sight. Yes, I hit. We are absolutely going to lose this game. But that's okay. horizontal come on there we go yeah I'm not gonna be able to get these 11 kills deep though not bad. Eh, 
I don't know. I don't play it. I don't have an interest in that. Hey, guys, you'd be surprised how little of interest I have for aircraft. I have them as uh, for Kaz, really, and some dogfighting, but I rarely bring them out for just in enjoyment of them, you know? Well, at least we did good. My team kind of did not, but that's all right. They tried. Hey, son, that's called an uncomfortable question. I'm not going to answer. Sorry, none against you, I promise. I get asked that a lot. And I'm just like, I'd rather not answer it. Because no matter which way I go about it, someone's going to be unhappy about it. Nice. All right, well, you've been bugging for the Claire. Let's do that after the IS3, yeah? Oops. Okay. I don't have any 100. I uh, I would love to have it one of these days, but it's it's not gonna be feasible for me to get because it would go against my uh, kind of like code of conduct, <laughs> if that makes sense. Uh, the E100 is a vehicle that is something you earn. You're a competitive player, or you do something just amazing, right? Um, being a content creator for it isn't like an amazing thing that would justify the E100 for me. Does that make sense? Um, so as much as I'd love to play it, trust me, I want it really, really, really badly. It, it would be an insult to those who earned it. So I don't do it. I7, I earned that vehicle, so I have it. I was there during the event and it sucked. Unfortunately, I was not able to get the last part. I think it was like the last two parts for it. I wasn't able to do it. So Gaijin was nice enough to just give me the vehicle as a creator, as a gift. So I'm like, you know what? I earned it. I feel like you're more comfortable on Twitch than here. YouTube. Oh yeah, it's a brand new audience. What do you expect? <laughs> I Believe it or not, I'm a little jittery right now. Good firecracker. Good. Good stream, good games. A lot of work to do today, but can't complain. Now that the media table is done, I got to work on a, a sponsored gig for uh, later this month. And uh, I got to work on a video for today for tomorrow's release, which is almost done. I just need to get maybe like maybe one or two more clips. Yeah, that'll be it. Uh, E100 usually is a tournament reward. Uh, unfortunately, Gaijin has yet to really bring out any modern events for it. Well competitive events that is and trust me when i say it's really sweaty the players who want to get it are really sweaty i wouldn't fight them so long well no no that was you know that the is 7 was one of the first crafting events in war thunder right it was one of them i don't know if it was the uh first one but man gaijin had high expectations and very few people met it and they realized that yeah maybe this is a bad idea let's let's tone it down a little bit and they did room for one more oh <laughs> ah okay Okay, okay, okay. I potato, oh, we're okay. That wasn't your cue to move up, but sure. I am potato play TV. Oh, they got him. I'm gonna stabilize your spoil the shit out of me. They got him. 
It's funny, so the, uh, the IH-3 is a heavy tank. It's meant to be a brawler. Get into the fight. Face first. Not a war thunder. How the advent of heats. Oh, I know what you're talking about. The th third plane. Um... I feel like it's a mechanic that guy just doesn't want to do right now. And there's only one vehicle that uses that, so... I don't think it would make sense for them to develop a whole new uh, piece of technology for the game. Just for one particular vehicle. Which is why Gaijin took so long to get the cheese wedge, you know, to, to work appropriately. Because there's only a handful of vehicles that actually play it, so like, eh, we'll just take our time with it. So why not? There's a tank in front of us, friendly. Sorry, I'm not exactly good, a good shot with this thing. I'm still at the bottom of the freaking board. Nope. My teammate was gonna get him, but I guess not. Sorry, I'm duty with this thing. Two gun sounds? Yeah, they're interesting. No, I'm just duty with this, to be honest. I haven't. Th this is the first time I've touched this vehicle in months. So, yeah. Uh, Abo 90, maybe. I don't think. I'm not a huge fan of it, so maybe. Uh, basically, it's... Um, so you have a two-plane, right? So you have the vertical and the horizontal, and then there's a third one, which I don't really know the word for it, but it basically... It keeps the turret level entirely. So as your vehicle moves, the turret will, will stay the same. Does that make sense? As opposed to just, you know, like that. It, it's kind of weird. Think of it like you're holding uh, like a like uh, a double bearing ball, more or less, right? And the it stays centered no matter what. Even if you twist it around, it'll stay centered. That's like the easiest way for me to explain it. And the only way that I can explain it. <laughs> A roll in size, yep. Take a gyroscope. That would be a super interesting thing to add to War Thunder. I'm surprised Gaijin has yet to do it. By the way, uh, Dancho and whoever else too, you guys realize that I can say gyroscope, but some people don't even understand what that is too. So I explain it in like the dumbest way possible. And that's not an insult either, I promise. He saw me. RU251, that's a dangerous vehicle. My goodness, this thing is bouncy as shit.
Right, at least I can get some points. Hey, there's another one right here. Cool. We're both useless. <laughs> Uh, there, I'm the only mod in chat. I don't have anyone uh, modding here. I don't. Uh, if I get mod privileges, they can also have access to like my videos and stuff, to delete them and whatnot. I think. So, I'm very, very picky about who I get mod on my YouTube, which is easy to do, thankfully. Not here. Uh, we'll be getting the uh, back sales probably soon. Ish. Which, by the way, if you guys do, you better use my 3% discount. Just don't use it with a K50. Finally. Tiger just shoots you. Oh, interesting. I know he's dead anyway, but interesting. <laughs> this poor guy over here. <laughs> Looks like a uh, Sudi's trumpet. I forget the name of it. Uh, you want my honest opinion? Okay, do you want my professional opinion on what I think about Britain in War Thunder? Or would you like my honest personal opinion uh, on it? Uh, my professional opinion on that... Uh, is Britain is a half decent nation to grind for I would say they have pretty well performing top tier vehicles The 7.3 lineups are really good APDS nerf, you know with shell shatter being a more consistent thing unfortunately uh, It still makes for a, a pretty viable nation for the most part the upper tiers They can hold their own not nearly as well as like the T-80s the Abrams or the Leopards I would say they're on the bottom tier almost uh, right next to the R-8s uh, But that really comes down to how you play it, right? If you're aggressive like me, it's not gonna work for you if you're very patient, precise, with a clear amount of map knowledge, oh, it's gonna it's gonna work pretty well for you. That's the professional opinion. My honest opinion is Britain's garbage, and I hate them. Simple as that. I hate playing them. They're slow. They're too inefficient compared to what's out there, and I would recommend against it almost every single chance. Their helicopters garbage. It's probably the best Apache, but it's still garbage. Uh, their jets, okay, still garbage. The Navy, don't play it, don't care. That's my honest opinion. <laughs> that's, that's, that's the truth. All right. I still play them. I still own all of them. I just, I, you won't actively, or see me actively play it. I'm sorry if I, uh, you know, hurt anyone's feelings with that, but that's my truth. I, I, I play like ass in this thing. <laughs> all right. Let's go play a little Claire. I would say it's worth investing in Israel if you don't have much to do in War Thunder. Like, say you already have all the nations you want and be like, you know what? I'm looking for a new nation to grind. Israel would be an okay choice. I would say Sweden first, of course, maybe even China, but Israel's all right. The problem with, uh, in my opinion, Israel is they're not efficient either. Their Merkavas are amazing, but their armor is bad. The two shells in the front and okay the two shells and the 6.7 second ace crew reload on an assisted loader is garbage and i will die on that hill by myself if i have to okay uh it is it's nice it's a nice vehicle but it's garbage the lic has better armor than all the other Merkavas because it's broken it's no sense <clears throat> Uh, Russia's the first, actually. USA's second. 
<laughs> oh, trust me, just because I'm a, I'm a gun-loving, freedom-loving American doesn't mean I'm going to be liking my Abrams, you know, all the time. Uh, handheld. No other way about it. <laughs> And it's so painful. Like, that's not terrible. I mean, I'm probably going to do poo-poo in it, but, you know, it's not terrible. I hate this map, and I hate it at nighttime. Well, the map, I don't mind too much. I just hate it at nighttime. <sighs> that's frustrating. That right there is probably a good reason as to uh, what I think about Russia's the home and help. That was gonna happen. Gotta pick my poison, huh? Same guy was shot too. He should have been dead, but Kajin said no. He's not gonna die. No, it's HC. I'm like, who's got an IR Dazzler? Oh, no. Uh, I think apparently the data mine said that uh, TDA's ammunition pro detonation probability is uh, 15, five, anywhere between 5 to 15 percent, whereas the uh, Type 10 is like 50 percent. Hey, demon. That's not an Abrams I'm listening to. That's a T80 I'm also listening to. Yep, there it is. Are you serious? Whoa, what the? Okay. No, the event hasn't started yet. That is satisfying to see. Although he's probably not gonna kill him, but that is still satisfying. We are going to lose this game, by the way. Oh, they got him. Nice. We'll play this game one more time after this, because I feel like this isn't a good representation of the little player. I mean, it is. Oh, it was the second one right there. Damn it. You know, I couldn't hear the second one because all I heard was boom, 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 boom from that. All right, this game's over. Let's do it again. F18. Really? Phantom with the same radar as the F18? That's interesting. Yeah. The Mercados need a buff. You know what's funny is Gaijin even said, they outright said to our faces that the Merkavas are overperforming. I, I just want to point something out. The Merkavas are overperforming.
sorry let me let me repeat that really quick i, I don't I think you guys heard that the Merkavas at 11.7 to 12.7 are overperforming. But the T80s are not overperforming. Just saying, you know, just observation is all point five <laughs> the summer sales uh i think so i hope it's 50 percent but i think it's going to be uh, combo packs. Want to hear a funny joke? Sure. Shoot. If it has a D's nuts in it, I'm banning you. I'm kidding. I'm not going to. <laughs> but no D's nuts. Listen the politicians. Sometimes. Eh, yeah, they got their good moments. They got their bad. You know. I have to count the good eggs, not the rotten ones. There's always one or two that come this way. It's not this time. Let me remove blah blah. We're removing the system. All right, it's not a viable option. Um, you know what? I'll be honest. I agree. Removing the economy system like SL and whatnot is not a viable thing, unfortunately. There has to be an incentive to grind, and having SL to repair your vehicle and everything, unfortunately, is in itself an incentive to have the players play better. Trust me, I, I have my disagreements with it, too. Like, how unfairly they, uh, they balance out vehicles with just SL costs and whatnot, like, a little bit too much. But I understand where they're coming from. Oh, okay. I love doing that. He left. Yep, he left. Okay. That means he didn't give away my, give away my uh, English. He did not give away my position, which is a good thing. I have a joke. I have a half joke, okay? Don't, don't take insulted, okay? It's a half joke. Uh, I have a solution. I've used this before, and I've used it several times. I have a solution for you guys if you don't like Kaz and War Thunder. And uh, trust me, I have my moments where I'm just like, dude, this is the most frustrating experience ever, right? But let me uh, let me show you my um, uh, let me show you my answer to that problem. Here you go. If you don't like uh, Kaz. This is, you know what, this, I guarantee you, 110%, you will not have Kaz in this game at all, okay? Just selling you right now. Do you want the link to it? It's a, it's a great game, by the way. You should try it. No Kaz.
Hey, it's not Kaz, though. It's not close air support. Oh. Ugh. It's just about to get the shot on him, too. I always feel like I get one-tapped really easily up on the Leclerc's. I think this game's over. Let's try. Come on. You know, I don't normally do terribly with the French either. I enjoy playing them. My uh, Mirage 2000 DR1 is like my incentive to play the, the French and play it moderately well. But right now I'm just, you know, I am playing like. I don't know if he realizes this or not, but he can shoot through this building. Not sure why, uh, if you're rear end exposed like that. There's your mistake. Well, you were bound. Oops, uh, you were bound anyway, bud. What's up, Dan? Tank. Oh, it's that striker I'm listening to. Oops. Okay, not good, not good, not good. I don't want the helicopter hopping over my head. I want to go for Bravo, but... Oh, wait a minute, wait, but the game's uh, over for him. Oops. Nah, I'm not making a real thanks video. I burn my bridges with board gaming. The games they make are okay, you know, even though they're blatantly cash grab, pay to win games almost. Um, I will never play a war gaming game ever. Ever. Sorry. War gaming has shown me that they don't care about the creators, and the only thing they care about is that. And don't get me wrong, Gajin ain't no, is not a saint either. They got their problems. But there's one thing I will actively defend Gajin for. They take care of the creators very, very well. And you know what? I'll disregard some of the asshats creators who left on, on a high note or on a low note, actually, I would say, not even a high note. Then who cares, right? But they take care of their creators very well. No eyes. Damn it. I was going no matter what way you swung that. No, it's not related to the World of Warship stuff I was supposed to do. Um, it's just how they treat the creators overall. I've heard so many horror stories about it and I'm just like, I'm good. I don't want to support this. So I have chosen to reject any and all sponsorships and they, they gave me really good ones too. Like the World of Warship stuff. Oh man, that, those ones pay really well too.
Yeah, give me a second. I love this thing. It's so fun. Like, this, this is my incentive to play uh, uh, France top tier. <laughs> ah. Oh, I was wondering what that was. Think out. Cool. Oh, it's amazing. I absolutely love the thing. <laughs> it really is. If I hit with guns. Oh, absolutely. Oh, wait, Dan, how did you know I had a World of Warship sponsorship? And if you, like, compared, uh, like, what I was saying to that. I'm curious. I play Israel for a little bit. I'll showcase them just a teeny tiny bit. Uh, the Harrier, yeah, it's, it's doable. I do it on occasion. How do they help the creators? Gaijin. Oh, of course, we're playing this map again. Um... Oh, that's who you are. Oh, hi, Danny. <laughs> I didn't know that was you. You're not consistent with your profile names, you dork. Uh, but Gaijin has actively defended us as creators. They've uh, they've uh, handled situations with copyrighted music, which is really awesome. There was a while ago, uh, there was this random no-name dickhead that was randomly uh, copy striking War Thunder's music. Any video that had it. Um, had their, had War Thunder music in it. They were they were trying to get money off of them, and it was at some at some points it was working. So Gaijin came out with a statement privately to us as creators, saying, "Hey, listen, we have this is our music. You have every right to use it in any fashion that you please because you're our creators. And uh, if you have any problem, give, send us the link, and we'll deal with it, right? And not even a week later, everyone got fixed." That's like, that's thing number one. Number two is uh, whenever there's like a bad situation going on with the game itself, uh, in terms of maybe some balancing stuff, uh, but maybe some bad creators or some bad actors, uh, they'll actively come out to our defense as well. Bad idea, way too far anyway. Oh my goodness, what? 263, are you serious? Ah! I am potato. I am absolute potato right now, holy shit. Oh, I'm absolute potato. There goes my freaking loader. At least I'm tanking these hits. Oh my goodness, that guy has so much ammo. Holy shit, how are we tanking all these hits? Don't ask. There it is. Oh, he, did. he used a heat FS too. Sorry, that was just me being a freaking potato. It's okay. Above expectation? No, those were just bad players. <laughs> nothing, nothing truly against them. It's just like bad moments, so. All right, my dumb ass should have been waiting there. I should have been more low. Uh, TD4. 
the Oplot? I'd love to see it. It's not gonna happen though. Not with the current mess going on right now. I would get more in discussion about it, but unfortunately YouTube will demonetize my ass very hard if I even mention it. So uh, I will only say that and big sad. Potato, don't worry. Gonna be able to armor on this thing? I think the other Mercabos would have died by now. Clever. I like this big light. Ridiculous, isn't it? I got my breach. That's all right. Perfect. No, that was actually a very smart backup player. I respect that entirely. Supposedly, I don't know how true this is. The uh, Mercabas are actually immune to tow 2 bs They have about 100 and what? 30, 140 millimeter of top armor, which mitigates against the tow 2 bs 100, 100 millimeter, I think it is, or 150 top down pen. Oh, TNM's coming. It's not a matter of, of if, it's a matter of when. I can shoot this building, I think. Yes, I can. Uh, when the event starts, I have no idea. Soon, I think. Pretty sure. Oops. Excuse me. Uh, only YouTube today. I got a lot of things I gotta, I gotta handle, including finishing the rest of Dead Island too. I'm just about done with the campaign. Uh, and then once I'm done with that, I'm gonna min max myself a little bit and then just uh, get working on the rest of my video. I'm excited for this one. I know it's not gonna do well. I 100% know it's not going to, but it's gonna be fun. And I hope you guys enjoy it. I really do. Uh, Merkaba is, can be, it's not terribly forgiving. Granted, I know I did show you guys I survived a bunch of hits. That's just because we had a bunch of terrible potato players. But uh, overall, it's like a 50 50, right? It's a huge mixed bag. Do you get any front? Hi. Bye. POV of a premium account. Fuck yeah, I do. Look, see that? We got premium status. I got every damn vehicle in the game, ground forces wise. And I still have premium. Fight me. Later, Ed.
I'm not kidding. This thing can take some weird hits. The LIC is like the best version of it. Finally got me. Radio right took one for the team. <laughs> uh, at 16 time. I didn't see any uh, any panseers. I could be wrong though. Oh, yes, there might be. say nothing all right let us have this israel needs something nice because right now they're 37 percent win rate to tell you everything you need to know someone's locking me i got a weird feeling it's a teammate I'll tell you what, the uh, that bus of a Panzer is not difficult to see in space. Oh, there he is. That's two S six. Thankfully, his missile is just absolute garbage. Fortunately, they had to nerf the two S six to make the Panzer look good. Ever. He waited for me to make my attack run. That's all I needed. Gotcha. That missile wanted you and it got you. Oh, I have to fight him. Oh, final blow. Yeah. The automatic? Oh man, it just automatic. I don't know why it's saying where it sits at. And you know what's funny? Gaijin made it so that it had a good ammo replenishment speed. And they took it away. They accidentally gave it to everybody. The uh type 10. It was five seconds universal, right? I got the UM uh, the UM2. And no, guys does not pay us for making videos. I'm not kidding. They don't pay us to make videos. Do you have any idea how awesome it would be if they did? No. Uh, you have two. Two. Hey, impurities. What's up, nerd? Oh. I have every ground vehicle. They're, they don't do sponsor videos for us. They do sponsor videos for other creators that play the games and have big audiences, but they 
there, there's no point of me getting paid to make a video for War Thunder when I want to make a War Thunder video anyway. <laughs> so it's all like, this video, this stream was brought to you by War Thunder. Do you want to have a free vehicle? Are you new to the game? Blah, blah, blah. No, it's not going to work. <laughs> not in the slightest. Uh, we are up to two. Up in three, I think. Uh, I mean, it's it's a it's a cool setup, but the cable management fucking sucks. But I'll tell you what, I am never gonna deal with cable management ever again because it's just it's pointless. I, I I can't. I don't know how people do it. I don't know how those 15, 16 year olds do it. Seriously. Oh, I'm 30 in like two weeks. Ugh. I'm old. Uh, around 8.387, I would say. 8.3 probably be the best. I don't know the 155. I was there during the event, but I completely missed out on it. And big sad. Sorry, I'm like focused right now. Sorry, I'm like laser focused. Give me a second. This is a bad spot for me. I gotta move. I gotta move now. I got in his cover, but. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm coming. Fuck. Oh, there it was. I didn't know there was two of them in there. this month is it mirrors the m35 such a pretty vehicle like it this is such a pretty helicopter although it's not, by no stretch is it a good helicopter uh it's still nice hey okay All uh, right. Didn't this thing used to carry 16, I think, uh, missiles at the start, but they nerfed it. All right. Pop them. No? Oh, you're not bringing any ammo in today, are you? Fine. Let's go for your turret bustle then. Oh, <laughs> I hit it too. All right, we'll get him later. Ah, didn't see that. Okay. <laughs> I just, I even hit him right in the ammo too, and nothing happened. Apparently. Oh, 
Now, what's funny is that we hit him on the ammunition from the front end, so we actually destroyed the, um, what do you call that? The plating separating the crew and the ammunition, but auto loader, etc. It still should have detonated the vehicle, but at least caused a blowout. Not even that. Except. On both pilots originally, yeah. Actually, I don't know if many of you guys remember this, but uh, helicopters used to have infinite range. That's right. Uh, the UH, the uh, the UH-1, the XM UH-1 or something like that, uh, used to have... You just, you just fly up, you engage, you land, do it again. You can get eight kills a game easily. I'm not a huge fan of the S250s. Oh, I was gonna say like you can easily outturn me buddy Now oh, this game's over mm -hmm. I prefer this cello and I, I got the 2s6, but I prefer this one Oh damn it What a shame, too. We made such a good rush at the very start, and it just wasn't enough. Oh, no, I've been playing it. Ah, of course. I've been playing the uh, AMD one. It's been a lot of fun. Yeah. All right, we're done. Out to the next one. At least at infinite range and shoot a shoot a pills both ways. Yep, pretty much. Imperius, you remember that? <laughs> Guys, I played more than War Thunder Mobile. I have it. I've had it before it became open access. Uh, it. I I don't care for it. I mean, I do, but I don't. I want to make a video on it, but at the same time, it's like, eh, you know, just eh. <laughs> I'm not going to fight the Mephisto. I don't like it. I'm sorry. The object 120? I don't like the 120 either. I'm not going to do that one. I'm sorry. And most certainly not the ZT3. That thing is garbage. I have tried maybe on like seven different occasions to make a video on that thing. And I just end up smashing my knuckles on the, on the side of my wall. And I'm just like, no, I'm good. <laughs> 9040 Bill. I saw that earlier. Uh, 10-0, I believe. Yes. Let's try it. I saw you coming, Philippe. Uh, the overrider or the override? Uh, I mean, you rip anyway, so no. You're just gonna, it's just, you're just gonna rip every single time you use it. You know that, right? Trust me, I love it in the F18 when I play DCS. Um, but the way War Thunder is, I promise you, the moment you use it, you're gonna rip. I've been playing DCS well for two years now. Maybe more than that. And I have yet to rip my F-18. I have the F-15, F-18, and MiG-29. And I have yet to rip any of them. But the moment I do the same shit in War Thunder, boom, off goes my wing. Oh, congratulations. You just uh, got a permanent ban from my channel. Goodbye. We got a first we got a first band <laughs> uh i played it a couple of couple of weeks ago but i needed pedals and i finally have pedals so <clears throat> i gotta work on that they're crap pedals by the way and now i'm not making videos for it 
I'm not a good pilot. Oh, did they fix a bug where if you lose your uh, commander, you can no longer use the tomo uh, or the missile launcher? Airsoft? No, I don't play airsoft anymore. I tried uh, a couple months ago. I think if I uh, if I played airsoft, if I continue playing it in the fashion that I was playing it previously, I probably would have gone to jail for punching a kid. Oh, absolutely. Oh, I wanted to strangle that kid so badly. I'm like, your parents won't do it. I'll do it. But jail's not fun, so no, I'm good. I don't think it was a bug. It was a feature. <laughs> I wouldn't doubt that either. hit him. Damn it. Alright, that's alright. Uh, no. It was it was more of a uh, just an asset player that just like, hey, these are all a bunch of new kids and they were breaking the engagement distance rule that I had set. Um, and they were playing on the same team when I told them like, hey guys, you guys are very good players. You know, these are all newbies. Can you guys switch it up? Okay, and then halfway through the game, they'd be on the same team again, and they just would wipe everyone out. And they would, you know, do that typical just, you know, paintball movements and shit. I'm just like, dude, you know what? All right. So, I think the worst part about it, too, was I separate. I'm like, hey, guys, if you want to play a slow game, you know, <clears throat> uh, cool, come, come this way. And they ended up just sneaking into the game anyway. I see that. Oh, shit. Too far. Too far. No, oh, come on. Come on. It's always got to be a helicopter, huh? Come on, gunner. Get back. Come back. Come back. Come back. I can't intercept that. I'm dead. Damn. Yeah, none I can do there. Let's go get him. I forgets. Uh, yeah, I think one of them is ready for him. I mean, the uh, the well, the new Chinese BMPT uh, is a clear example of War Thunder, I guess, sort of being ready because there's such a broken system in the bad sense that I guess it's okay if they're here. But going back to the airsoft subject, I just, I realized that the airsoft and community uh, are full of shitbags. And not in the, in the sense that they're bad players or something like that. It's just, you either have the little dick nugget kids who just run around trading it like paintball, or you have the try hard mill simmers who all they do is look pretty and don't play the game. Try hard in the sense that they try really hard to, to look good. We're not dead yet. For like all they do is just they sit there and look pretty and don't play the game. Like, are you serious? I paid a hundred bucks to be in this op, and you guys are just standing around being like, "Look at my cry and my nods in the middle of the day." Like, <laughs> uh, I don't miss it. I have a very expensive airsoft gun right behind me too, it's chilling right there. The Polar Star. I built it myself. 
Uh, they're gonna get the T90. Not next update, I think. I think, but they will get it. And they won't fix APTS. If Gaijin broke it deliberately right now, they won't fix it. Hey, Hassan, uh, English, please. Welcome to the stream. But, uh, English, if you could. I, I can't, I can't read that. So, <laughs> for the safety of the stream, uh, and, you know, everything. English, please. I mean, I, I, don't, I don't have to bring it out right now. It's just, it's just a, uh, it's a version 2 Gen 3 Polar Star Fusion Engine. Um, you know, purple nozzle, purple, uh, purple poppet, right? Uh, Orga, I think a 363 millimeter, 6.23 bore, flat hop with a uh, max hop up. It's really nice. Why no other languages? Because I don't speak those languages. I can't read them. I can't understand them. They could be saying something inappropriate and I wouldn't know. And YouTube can be like, hey, you didn't moderate your chat. You're in trouble. It's like, well, I can't read the language. So how can I moderate it if I don't understand it? So normally it's fine in videos right because i can just use translate i just click on it translate good to go doesn't work in the live fashion though the german mbt is about 11 0. that's true oh we lose oh yeah hard <laughs> bad day of games for me huh trust me i like seeing uh I like seeing you guys use your native tongues. I promise. It's just, I wish I could understand them. I really hope they just bring in the spikes for the existing Puma and not add another Puma. It would be kind of counterproductive if we had a 9.7 Puma and then like a 10.3 with spikes. It's like, no, guys, just quit adding a new vehicle. Just add it to the existing one, right? Like how you gave the tow two A's to the Bradley, same thing. But we'll see. How it might even be premium, who knows? Oh. Big sad. Let's do it again. Imagine a premium. I mean, we already have a premium 2S38, so it's like, why, why not add a Puma at this point, guys? And you're already going balls to the wall. At this point, you're just throwing shit at the wall and seeing what sticks. Apparently, that's stuck. Hey, Jaden. Rook 105, I think it's worth it. I'm not even trying to sell it to you either. I think it's worth it. Wait for the sales. Uh, They should be starting pretty soon. Um, But I would say most certainly even at that point. Yes, I would say, yeah. Right now, even still. Sweden's in a good position right now. Whichever way you go, it's be the same. I mean, where do you have the the uh, TCV? It, oh my goodness, I, I can't believe I forgot the name of. Um, VRCC, that's it. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, we already have that, which is perfect, I think. I mean, perfect under the given circumstances of high tier premiums. Uh, in truth, I don't like high tier premiums. I think they take away from the experience of War Thunder uh, and the grind necessary to say, hey, I got the top tier, but it's like, why? You can just bring out a premium vehicle and pretty much play top, top tier. Uh, yeah, I'd say the... Uh, Kipar 182 should be at 9.3. It would kind of make the Ozzelot a little redundant, though. But at the same time, it's like... You know, less missiles, bigger poison, bigger profile. Oh, oh, so you fixed it, huh, Gaijin? Yeah, you fixed it. Yeah, you did. 
Oh, oh, trees now disappear appropriately when you shoot them. Ladies and gentlemen, this is why when I ever uh, I say, hey, they have fixes, take it with a big ass grain of salt. Now that I say something. <laughs> Don't worry, I saw my mark. No, it's the same. Nice. Perfect. More insult. <laughs> uh, need to complain, it suddenly works. Oh, yeah. If you guys are having a long queue time, just start complaining about it and it'll just throw you into a game. Type 90. I think his armor is just doo doo. Sorry, buddy. Basically hit him with it. Oh, you scared the shit out of me. We're doing pretty good. Just a mess with them. <laughs> Actually, I think they have one uh, for creators. All right, didn't look like a ordinance on them. I think I should be okay. Should be. Oh, I just missed. Son of a bitch. They got him. Nice. That's so satisfying to see. Oh, hi, me. Hey. Ah. Guess what? He peed on my bed last night. So I had to sleep on this chair. You're banned from my bed, but it's okay. I'm gonna come, I'm gonna like get him a bigger bed so he can sleep next to me. So if he pees anywhere, it's not going to be on my bed. Right, you little rat? Huh? <laughs> it's okay, my boy. What's up? You hungry? Yeah, you are. I'll feed you later. Okay. Huh. Come here, boy. Casually. Woo! He scared the shit out of me. Wait, how did I save your life casually? What? Oh, hi. I don't know which one you you are, but hi. Target coming up behind. Me. 
Uh, for the Germans. Hots? There's 38 front. One time I deeply enjoy the use of uh, top down missiles. Oh, you're in the rolling. Keep the skies clear, buddy. What do you mean an obstacle prevents launch? Are you serious? There is... There we go. Alright, four missiles. I think we're good with this right now. I'm pretty sure you just hit me with a missile and I survived that. Uh, not in today's stream. Maybe in uh, ground RB, of course, but not as like a straight air RB. Oh, Not a friendly. I heard another engine. It's not a friendly at all. Not that one. Brazil, Victor, I appreciate that. Welcome to the stream. Oh, son of a bitch. I don't know where that came from. Nice try. That rock got him killed. I knew I wasn't going crazy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if I only have two crew members, I lose access to the launcher. That's dumb. Gadget needs to fix that. my go-to food um right now my go-to is these chicken patties i have in the freezer grab some regular buns that i have downstairs some bread like slices of bread put a little bit of mayo on it and uh, have myself a uh, chicken sandwich two vehicles front i got a light tank of some sort and i got this bad boy right here Doesn't want to play with this. Oh, 
Perfect. Alright. Let's go, uh, Rick Room. I... How do... Okay, mayo is... Is bad for me. Hey, trust me. I, I get acid burn just out the ass. Okay, no pun intended. Um... But it's really bad, right? Because I am terribly lactose intolerant. But I still deeply enjoy, you know, my chocolate milk and my eggs. Or actually, eggs don't really count, but my mayonnaise and whatnot. But, oh. Worth it. <laughs> um, on the fifth sale, I'm sorry. Uh, I used to do uh, GE wages in the past. I just hoard them now. I don't really use wages or... Um, I sell boost or anything anymore. Nothing. This is live. <laughs> I, dude, it feels like a video, doesn't it? Just 1440p, and I'm recording, I'm streaming this at about half the bit rate I normally would for my videos. I, I record at 40,000 bit rate uh, for each of my clips, which are fairly immense file sizes, right? Uh, until I get to, until Vegas gets AV1 encoding, editing, I'm stuck with uh, H264. I forget, I'll have to check. But it's nice, isn't it? Works with YouTube. Yeah, a stream will be available to watch later. Like a normal video. You can go in there, comment normally, you know, like, dislike. That's about it. Uh, Premiere Pro, eh, I don't want to pay the 60 bucks a month, you know, for them. I'm already paying $60 for uh, uh, Sapphire FX plugin for Vegas. I have DaVinci. I've been learning how to use it, but it's, it's so different to what I use normally that... I'm really hesitant. Nice. <laughs> That's so satisfying. It really is. Yeah. I kills though. I'll take it. <clears throat> I I don't do cracked anymore. I, as much as I'd love to, I don't do cracked. I tried for Sapphire though, but for legal reasons, I'm gonna say it was unsuccessful. Well, yeah remember this is youtube so <laughs> anyways i'm gonna go ahead and bump out uh it, we're hitting our uh, our mark here but i want to go ahead and say thank you guys so much for tuning in and hanging out and being super awesome etc uh let me switch it out and we'll just do a little outro <clears throat> um i won't get in that conversation i have my opinions and views uh i will say that roms are a good thing because Fuck Nintendo. <laughs> but, um, too small. What do you suggest? Ah, holy shit. I, I thought I had big ears. Look, I'm just joking, by the way. But I don't know. Personally, I, I like Steel Series. They've always worked for me. So, but guys, thank you so much for being here and being super awesome. I'm going to try to see if I can do a, uh, a second YouTube stream a week as opposed to maybe our three or four Twitch streams a week. I'll just do uh to youtube and then like three twitch kind of thing and just you know level things out a little bit i do plan on cutting a stream anyway so that i have more time to focus on other content as well as here on the channel you know existing war thunder stuff i will be working on a different video today too uh it should be it's it's almost done like how many clips do i have let me i'm, I'm gonna tease you with it a little bit how many clips do i got i have one uh no one two three four five clips but i need more so yeah, tomorrow, look forward to it. <laughs> uh, they're moving, uh, pulling of vehicles. I have no idea. But anyways, there's no rating or anything here. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, stop the stream. But guys, as always, thank you so much for being here. If you want to see more gameplay, more live streams, etc., on a more consistent basis, my live streams on Twitch are a big area to go to. And also one more thing too, don't forget to use my 3% discount if you guys buy anything in the War Thunder store. I don't care what it is. It could be um, Golden Eagles. It could be vehicle packs, whatever. Premium time. Uh, it supports me as a creator. Okay, Mickey? I think he wants to go outside now. Okay. I'm going to go tend to the pup. So, guys, thank you. Until next time, good night, good luck, have fun. Don't catch the Rona. You know the whole deal.